Hello everyone, welcome to yet another haul video. A bunch of this was sent to me, a bunch of it I ordered, there'll be a giveaway at the end. Um, some, well, a little tiny bit of it I've already, I've already used. Thought I would just include all of it, because a lot of you have commented saying you like haul videos, you like the format, you like me showing, etc, etc, etc. So, let's just jump into it. Uh, first thing is the Sketched Flowers stamp set. This was part of Simon's October card kit that was released like a couple weeks ago, roughly, because um, they always release like the month before. So this month in October, it'll be the November kit that will get released in about a little over a week from now. So anyway, by the time the kit showed up to me here in Canada, <laughs> it had already sold out. So I didn't do an unboxing video of it because anyone who wasn't a subscriber couldn't get the kit, but the stamp set is available separately and the stamp set's gorgeous. I've had it sitting here, I have it ready to go, I have so many ideas, but I just wanted to show just the stamp set because this, I, I've said this before, I love the large, the huge flower cluster images. There's just something about them. I absolutely love them. And then there's all these like sentiments with sympathy and love, thinking of you, you're in my thoughts, sending hugs, congrats, happy birthdays to you, there's a hello, a thanks, a smile, so happy you're my friend, love you, um, get well soon. Like really nice stamp set. So this is a big six by eight set. Huge. So we've got that. And then we've got some fun Halloween stuff that Whimsy sent me. It's just so adorable. Again, it's literally been like sitting on my desk for a while now. So there's this really fun um, background stamp, which isn't Halloween themed. This is just the galaxy galore background. And it's just these fun kind of whimsical stars in all sorts of different patterns. Their backgrounds are red rubber. They're like the six by six. I just kind of like the whimsical nature of this. I think this would look so cute. Um, either do, you know, a really fun, messy alcohol ink background and then use this with the lift ink. That would look really cool. Or like heat emboss this over an actual, you know, galaxy background. Like it's just, it's just cute. I love it. So there's that. And then there's this really fun stencil. This is the Halloween creatures stencil. I've said this before, I don't like spiders at all. R actual real bats also creep me out, but it's not like you see bats very often. But for Halloween stuff, I was thinking the glitter paste that I've been kind of obsessed with would look really fun over this. Same with the bats too. Just fun, really. So there's a the stencil and there's just really fun stamp sets. I love the sentiment set because that's one thing I find the hardest is I can find Halloween stamps, you know. There's more and more companies coming out with stuff, which I love because I love crafting for Halloween. But stamp sets that are more specifically Halloween, like sentiment stamps, not as many of them. So yeah, this one is the You're My Boo. <laughs> so you've got, you know, Halloween, treat, haunted, and then a bunch of words, you know, to spell out different phrases. So I really like that. Really like that. So I got that one. And then this one is the um, Cute But Psycho. You have this funny little, you know, um, angry looking little girl and this awesome like haunted house um, backdrop. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day, ha! Huh? Yeah, psycho friend, cute but psycho but cute. Um, blondes, redheads, brunettes, make better psychos, having friends with uh, the same mental disorder, priceless. Um, sometimes I open my mouth and my mother comes out. So yeah, depends on the sense of humor. Some people don't like those sorts of things. I, I'm, I'm pretty open. Everything's kind of open game for fun, but <clears throat> just saying, uh, not for everyone. I just, I think it's kind of, I actually think the set's kind of cute. Just, I have certain people in my life that, you know, they would get a really good chuckle out of that. So there's that one. And then we've got this one, which is Joe Zombie. So you've got a fun little like zombie and these like oh, goofy little hearts. Your love infects me. Um, love to have you for dinner sometime. I like that. Um, in case of zombies, I'm so tripping you. Joe Zombie, not the sharpest tool in the shed. I love you for your brains. You're so cute. I could just eat you up. Zombies, not just for Halloween anymore. Happier. <laughs> That's cute. Uh, and last but not least, um, this is the Halloweeners stamp set. So we've got, you know, cute, more, more cutesy little characters. I like how the cat is. That's cute. 
Um, warning, I don't play nice. Booyah, self. Trick or treat. What up, boo boo? Bring me candy minion. Um, don't make me give you this stink eye. Going batty, want to come. I think you're yummy. Wrapping you in a big hug. Happy Halloween. So, just cute. Just cute. So, we've got that one. And then we have the Waffle Flower October release. I already did a blog post with cards um, showing a couple of these little stamps. And then I have more that I'm going to be making and sharing because there's some really neat dies and stuff in this release too. This is most of it. There's one other stamp. I think it was just one other stamp. But yeah, we have the Hello Pumpkin stamp set. There's coordinating dies for it. That's the one I used already on my last video. And then there's this cute little mini one. This is just the coffee time. A little to-go cup and the sentiment. And then there is a coordinating die as well. I just keep mine stored together. And then we have this really neat um, Christmas tree stamp set. Which is just kind of funny looking. You've got the solid, like, you know, joy stamp. And then to the world, Merry Christmas. And then some little, like, images. And then these really funky looking wafer dies. These, once you actually see it come together, they make a lot more sense. These are two separate die sets. I've already cut everything apart so that I can start running them through. But you've got this um, tree die with all of the score lines and everything. And then there's like a pull tab. And then there's this one that cuts out a bunch of notches and like all these funny little pieces. And there's already videos as part of the hop showing like how these all come together to create the coolest, three-dimensional tree that you can use on the outside and inside of the card and then you pull the tab and it'll pop up but it'll mail flat so obviously me talk I, I'm I need, I'm running out of time today I'd wanted to have one made up before I film this but I literally it's like I've got you know 15 minutes to quickly do this but like I said I'm gonna do a video making a couple of cards with this and show how easy it is and how fun it is once it comes together it's like this is cute so really neat um, concept and just quirky, just like, you know, Waffle Flower makes some of the neatest little quirky dies and I just love it. So that's those ones. And then we have the super cute, I love this one. This is the um, Sweater Weather stamp set. I don't know what it is. I don't I have a thing for like clothing stamps. That was, yeah. So you got a, like a plain sweater and then one with a pattern on it. And I like the plain one too because you can obviously like stamp it on pattern paper or stamp these. I like how there's these dots you can stamp on the sleeves. So you can choose whether you want to add patterns to it. Leave it as is, paper piece it, whatever. So yeah, we've got hello, love, enjoy the sweater weather. How cute. And then there is um, a coordinating die set as well. So you can die cut these and I just, I think it's just adorable. Love it. And then last but not least of what I have, this is the Yippee stamp set. And again, I think this is the cute. I love all these sets. Um, they're by Camo and they are just, these little characters are so cute. And just like the mice ones, I was talking about the mice in my previous video and how there's several sets with these mice. So you can interchange the little characters, you know, the stamps, etc., and like do them together. You can do the same thing with all the little people sets from Waffle Flower. They're all done, you know, in the same style and similar sizes. So you can, you know, mix and match and create all sorts of little fun scenes. So really, really cute. Coordinating wafer die set two for all of these. And I just, there's just something about them that I think is the cutest thing ever, ever. So we've got that. And then last but not least is the USPS finally came through. I keep blaming Canada Post for this, but actually it's the USPS that has really dropped the ball the last like month or so. Um, things have been just looking at the tracking and it's still in the States and it's just all over. I'm waiting on another large Halloween parcel um, that, I don't know why, it just keeps going back and forth in Chicago for some reason and I'm just so frustrated. So anywho, my Lawn Fawn fall, fall order, a um, couple little winter things finally showed up. So I got um, the new Ink Cube sets. So there's Peach Fuzz, Artichoke, Ballet Slippers, and Cranberry. I really like Lone Fun things. I need to reach for them more often. Like I'm getting, I have like all their cubes. So really like those. So I got those. And then I got this super, super cute. This was the Winter Skies stamp set that was part of the fall release. And I just, 
these little characters. You got bears and foxes, you know, staring at the sky. You got a little silhouette of like Santa. Sentiments, wishing you and your family um, a magical Christmas, winter, thinking of you this holiday, this winter. Hope your dreams come true. Like, isn't it so cute? There's coordinating die set, of course. So I got that. Finally got my hands on the caramel apple. I've been waiting for this. I was like, I don't want to do Halloween cards. So yeah, you're the caramel apple of my eye. You got two little smiley faces. You can stamp and a little bow. Little, um, well it's in there. It's a coordinating die set. I love the Lawn Fun mini sets because it's just, how can you not collect them? They're always so cute and they're so cheap and I love them. I have almost all of them. Or, well, I have a lot. Anyway. Uh, spooky Fence Wafer Die. Finally have it. So I'm still planning on doing Halloween. This was the other one I was really waiting for. This was the pick of the patch stamp set. So your fun little pumpkins, all little pumpkin faces. There's even a little knife, which just, I don't know, that just cracks me up. Pumpkin guts, two little squirrels that can be, you know, doing all this. I love the glasses too. Like how cute is this? So yeah, I've carved out time to say have a very happy Halloween. Uh, fall, pick of the patch, beautiful, smile, it's Halloween, like, it's so cute. Coordinating wafer die set. I love it. It'll cut out the glasses and it'll actually cut out the little center parts too. So you could stick them right over, you know, their little faces. So cute. So I got that. Um, I'm going to set that aside for a minute. I also got the Reveal Wheel Square add-on. The Reveal Wheel Fall Leaf add-on. And the Reveal Wheel Pick of the Patch add-on. Um, there was other ones too. There was a star one and a snowflake. And yeah, I still haven't used my reveal wheel set. I'll link to it. I'm planning. I have all these ideas. So I love that you, there's the square option now as well. These all fit in. I'm going to do a video. I'm going to, I'm going to do videos using these. So I just like all these options and it just, you know, it just adds extra you know you get the one big die set and then lawn funnel release you know little companion little small sets just to give you more bang for your buck as far as i'm concerned which is why this is awesome to you this is the reveal wheel holiday sentiments because there's the original set so now we've got all of these different little sentiments that you can use that will show up inside these windows so you got merry and cheery and joyful bright jolly cozy happy fun da -da 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 -da. holly jolly merry christmas happy holiday Happy everything, etc., 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 and they're all size, you know, to kind of fit within these windows. So I love that. And then last but certainly not least, yes, because I wanted to save those. So these are all part of this, and then this goes here. Okay, and then last but not least, I got the Woodland Critters. I need to put this up so I can actually read the proper name. Woodland Critter Huggers Winter Add-on because I have the Woodland Critter Hud blah, blah, blah. Woodland Critter Huggers wafer die set. I did was that Valentine's I think, yeah, if I remember. I did a little Valentine's with me with the little Woodland Critter Huggers wafer dies and made cute little Valentines with those. So now there's this add-on set with like you know a little Santa hat and mittens and all these little accessories that you can add to them to make them winter themed. How cute is this? Seriously, like this is why Lawn Fun gets all my money because I'm just obsessed, obsessed, obsessed. So this brings me to the giveaway. So I had ordered this as well way back when, before you failed, and Lawn Fun had actually sent me these. I already did a video using, this is the double slider surprise wafer die. I did my first Halloween video this year was using this wafer die. And then um, Lawn Fun had also sent me this awesome Thanks a Latte stamp set, which of course I had ordered because I want it, and the Courtney dies. So, since I already have this and this, I am going to um, give them away to one of you guys. The giveaway will be on my blog. Like always, I will always post a link to my blog. It'll be the first link directly below the video. So you can go there. There'll be a little raffle cup order widget that you can... Um, go through the steps or whatever just to be entered. And then when the time's up, I will choose a random winner and mail out these fun, super fun little goodies. And these go together so well. It's actually why I originally ordered them. Cause I was like, this would be so cute to do a slider card and it would slide out in a gift card and all that fun stuff. So really fun little prize pack. So um, if you're interested in that, check it out below. I will also link 
to everything. I'll have all those links um, in the description box below, as well as on my blog. On my blog, it's like, you know, the actual picture links so you can see everything. So check that out below if you are interested. Thank you all so much for watching and for subscribing and for thumbs upping and commenting on my videos. I really, really appreciate it. I've been doing, I kept saying, I had giveaways planned, I had giveaways planned. And now I'm a bit, a lot more organized since the move, keeping track of things and able to really start doing all these giveaways that I kept, you know, alluding to. So they've been fun and I've been loving like brightening people's days with these little random giveaways and sending things to people. So again, thank you. It's because you guys watch and people use my affiliate links, etc., that I am able to, you know, continue doing stuff like this. And I love it. So thank you. Stay tuned. I will have videos. I promise I'm going to cut into, oh, and uh, yeah, um, nitpicky. I already showed these in a previous haul, so now I have extras, thankfully, because I actually have been. I used this in my last video, too. That's why, and just in case everyone's like, why did you not show these papers? Um, yeah, showed them in another haul video, like, a little while ago. Great ones, too, but I'll link to them. The nitpicky fall and the really rainbow Christmas. Super cute. Super cute. So I've been using the nitpicky quite a bit for like fall themed and whatnot. So really fun. So anywho, all the links will be below. Thank you guys so much. Giveaway is over on my blog. That will be linked below. And stay tuned because I am going to have a whole bunch more videos coming. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing, thumbs upping, all those good things. And I will see you all very soon in the next video.